What can police do about blackmail? Hey there, and welcome back to our channel. Today we're diving into a serious and often frightening issue, blackmail. Whether it's happening through social media or other online platforms, blackmail can leave you feeling powerless and unsure of what to do next. This video will explore what steps you can take and what actually law enforcement can do to help. Before we get started, if you've experienced extortion or blackmail on any platform, whether it's Instagram, Snapchat, or WhatsApp, make sure to check out our channel. We have over 50 hours of material and videos offering actionable solutions and DIY advice to help you navigate and combat online blackmail and extortion. What can police do about blackmail? So what can the police do if you're being blackmailed? First off, it's crucial to report the incident to your local police department. They can open an investigation and take steps to identify the perpetrator. Police can also provide you with resources and support services to help you cope with the emotional stress. They can also guide you on how to preserve evidence, which is vital for any legal action. However, while the police can be a significant ally, their ability to intervene effectively often depends on the specifics of the case and the laws in your jurisdiction. Do police departments have the tools to combat blackmail effectively? Well, not really, but they do try. Many departments lack the specialized tools and training required to handle sophisticated online blackmail schemes. Often, they rely on traditional investigative methods, which may be not as effective in the digital realm. While some larger departments may have cybercrime units, smaller departments might struggle with these types of cases. Despite these limitations, reporting to the police is still a critical step in taking action. Now, how effective are police departments when it comes to handling online blackmail and extortion? Well, according to recent statistics, only about 15% of online blackmail cases result in an arrest. This low success rate is partly due to the anonymous nature of the internet and the challenges in tracking down perpetrators who may be located in different jurisdictions. However, even with these challenges, involving law enforcement can add pressure on the blackmailer and potentially deter further actions. What can you do if the police are taking too long to act? In such cases, it's essential to seek additional help. Contact our company, Digital Investigation, at 800 790 Four, five to four, or visit us at digitalinvestigation.com. We specialize in dealing with online blackmail and extortion, offering professional services to expedite the investigation and resolution process. Our experts can assist you in gathering evidence, locating and identifying the perpetrator, and taking the necessary steps to protect yourself against these criminals. Conclusion To recap, while the police can be helpful resource in combating blackmail, their effectiveness can be limited due to various factors. If you find yourself in need of urgent assistance, don't hesitate to reach out to us at Digital Investigation for expert help. Don't forget to call us at 800-790-4524 or visit digitalinvestigation.com for more information. And make sure to subscribe to our channel for more tips and advice on staying safe online. Thank you for watching and stay safe out there. Until next time.